time, I, I think it might be nice to mention our sponsor. Our sponsor for this hour is Network Redux, which is an open source hosting company here in, here in. Here in Portland. Anyone can use them, though. So if you go to networkredux.com, you can sign up for an account there. Um, they, ho they host a bunch of open source projects. Perhaps the most notable ones are the Camino web browser for Macs and also Adium, which is a multiple IM client for Macs. Both of those are hosted by Network Redux. And the charity that we're sponsoring this hour is Pear. This is the last hour for now with Pear. I mean, there'll be more Pear time tomorrow. But we're doing back. it. Yeah, we're doing it in three-hour shifts. So the first two hours are Pear. Six o'clock hour is also Pear. And uh, you can go and donate to that right now. Yeah, 30hourday.org. Just click the Donate Now button. That'll take you to causes, and you can make your donation to Pear. You know, we have something really, aside from the iPhone app that we have this time, we've got something else very exciting that we didn't have last time, and that's an intro. Oh, we have an intro. I haven't seen it. I'm wondering if the intro is available. I don't know. Mm. It might be. <laughs> I wonder. I'm thinking maybe it's not quite. Eh. I'm thinking that the person who has it ready is know. on the other side of the stage talking. Yeah. So let's just talk instead. Okay. In what else have we got coming up? In two hours. At eight o'clock. Yeah. What? I'm going to tell you guys, this is actually really the only part of the whole entire 30-hour day, aside from the zombies that I'm afraid of. <laughs> and I'm only remotely afraid of the zombies because I know they can't come out of the TV to get me. That's later. As long as Martin doesn't bring any real zombies, I'll be fine. We're going to have dance lessons. Swing, swing dance. Swing dance lessons. lessons. Yeah. And a good band. To, to play. The Twang Shifters are going to be here. Are gonna be yeah, here. and yeah. Frankie Cheese is going to come and teach us how to dance. I yeah. told Frankie that I can't dance. I warned Frankie that I cannot dance. You've got a good partner, though, who can dance. Well, that's the thing. So what I'm wondering is this. My partner is an amazing dancer. It's Jason Grigsby. The Internet's Jason Grigsby. Yeah, I don't know if you've ever seen him of Cloud 4. Yes. If you haven't seen Jason Grigsby dance, you're in for quite a treat. So Jason, being a phenomenal dancer, yeah. and me being, <laughs> I don't dance. I don't, I don't know how good my dance partner is. I don't know. I don't know if she can dance, but you've got Stephanie Strickland of KGW. Yeah, of the Square yeah. fame, Live at 7. And she's a lovely lady. She is. Uh, even if she did step on your feet, it wouldn't really hurt. No, she's <laughs> She's tidy. Bitty bitty. It's yeah. not um, So what happens, what I want to know is this. Okay. Does Jason's um, amazing ability as a dancer improve me, or do, does my lack of skills detract from his amazingness. No, it's all about following the lead. Okay, so I So you just follow his lead and you'll be amazed. What happens just if like he throws him. me? Well, that's what they do. What if I don't, yeah. What if you don't throw? <laughs> <laughs> what, if, what if you don't go anywhere when he throws? I don't yes. know. I don't know. We'll don't just know. have to play it by ear. So I've suddenly become incredibly worried about something. May I share my concern with you? Absolutely, please We're, do. This is a live event. It's a yes. live event out in public. Hi. In the public, in the open air, and we're in, in Portland's living room. In Portland, in the open air means yeah, lots of in, people walking in the by. rain, and yeah. that's all good. But there's this giant bubble that's formed. Oh, in, in the tent. In the tent, and I'm really concerned. Yeah, it's that right over gonna, one of the cameras. Yeah, too. I'm really concerned that this camera. I, and I'm not joking. I'm actually trying to get someone. Tyler, thank you. I'm really worried about the. <laughs> thank you. I'm, <laughs> someone yeah. might want to. Someone might want to poke that with a stick. Poke I'm just that saying. bubble. Good eye. Oh, That's awesome. Thank you. Yeah, well done. I, I have to find things to be nervous about oh. every once in a while. <laughs> so uh, I saw the, the lovely lady that made the intros that we can't yet play is here. Yeah? Yeah. Well. We, yeah. Oh, I thought he was talking to us. <laughs> it's, it's, people are yelling. There's stuff going on. Just stay right here. We're good. I thought this 30-hour day was going to have less of us talking. No, this is, yeah. And no. more of other people doing We're stuff. tap dancing right now, waiting for the change out to occur. Do, 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 yep. do, do. Hey, at least the, Somebody's at least talking the mics to me. work. Oh, that's I got very something. exciting. No? <laughs> we're, we're Breaking teaching. news? Maybe I'm just going to go off stage for a moment and, and put oh, my IFB on. Great. Or I could do it on stage. Everyone could that's see fine. how people I need to see the IFB. Behind okay. the scenes? I don't know. It's all about the, the open source behind the scenes stuff. Yeah, I just didn't have time to put the IFB on before, uh, yeah. before the guys uh, ended their set. And I can't 
hear our mic right now. I can hear okay. static, but... Well, do you want me to change your volume? Sure. You want to yeah. do that? Oh, I got something there. We're just getting ready. Band's oh, changing now. The They're getting close. Target for tomorrow. If you're, if you're out, if you're in Portland, I don't know. if you're at Beer and Blog watching the stream, whatever, come on down to the square. Come on down and hang out. Look at all the people. Listen there, how loud it is. There may be a little love for beer and blog. It's craziness. So come on down. Oh, Target can for someone, oh, can get, someone a get a camera on Jay? Get camera ready to Jay poke Robert, the please. Please. poke the thing. Please. This is going to be good. This is like oh look, that's a great shot. Yeah, excellent. This Thank is you live so much, entertainment at its best. Oh. Whoa, there we go. Yeah, that's fantastic. Nice. That's Thank excellent. Thank you. There's more. There's more up there. I oh, love that look. the stick is a mic stand. Yeah. Well, we'll get there. <laughs> <laughs> Hit it harder. The crowd is cheering. <laughs> Woo! Woo! All right. <laughs> well done. Wow. All I right. really hope all those cables are waterproof. Yeah. Here, could you hold my mic for me? Yes, absolutely. All right. Oh. So you're gonna keep talking. Yeah. So we got sure, people I'll, running I'll around. Talk. We got I'm Target for tomorrow. Volume. Your volume's at full. By the way, it is. I can so barely hear. I'm sorry to hear That's that. That's all right. So what we're going to do, we're going to move some monitors out of the water. Yeah. Oh, and, thank you, uh, And then we're going to, we're going to, <laughs> we're going to, we're going to get Target for tomorrow all set up here. There's keyboards. There's horns of destruction. There's all kinds of stuff yeah. going on. And these guys are great. Like, seriously, if you're in Portland, hop on the Max, get in your car, get down quickly, here now. Quickly, quickly. You got, you got to see these guys live. Because they're amazing. We, we should not, and we should not be telling people to get in their car. This is Portland. We should tell them to ride oh, their right. bike. Ride your, ride your or, bike. Um, or get or, on the max, or, or the use, max. use public transit. Yeah, public transit. One of those transit. things. Come on down. Okay. If you're not in Portland, but you're watching the live stream, and you're like, I'm tired of watching these two talk, donate. just hang out for oh, a little while longer. Say, donate some money. Target for tomorrow. I'll be here in a sec. All right. I've got my IFB in. Now. You can donate it as look well. Good, though. Donating is donating is good, and you can also buy a T-shirt or buy a copy of Gadget Track. Both of those things will also give you um, a way to donate to Thirty Hour Day, and you can Correct. buy a T-shirt where can you we? can buy a T-shirt at the Last Stand Online. Can you click this? Seriously, yes. I can't. Yeah, so yeah, go yeah. to the Last Stand Online. The Last Stand is a zombie web series. It's just finished its first series, and they'll be uh, creating a second series soon. <laughs> I think we're entertaining people not on purpose. Right, there we go. With our There's like with our inability to, to have our well, IFB we're trying. installed properly. Yeah. So yes, you can go to the last stand online and buy a t shirt and all the proceeds from that will go to uh, a charity from thirty hour day. Yep. Or yeah. you can go and um, buy Gadget Track. Right, and Gadget Track is G A D G E T trak dot com, yes. and that software will help protect your laptop or mobile phone should it be stolen. Um, you'll be able to locate it by geolocation. You'll be able to take pictures of the person using the laptop. Really cool software, and they agreed that anyone who purchased Gadget Track during Thirty Hour Day, all that money would be donated to the cause. Hey, Rick. Yeah. I think the sun's coming out. It is. Maybe a little. Aside from right here in front of the stage, the yeah. bricks are dry. Yeah, everything's stuff starting to happen. I didn't notice it Clouds at first because the stage lights are very hot, glaring in my eyes. Yeah. But but the sun is coming out in Portland just in time for the sun to go down. Actually, yeah, that's awesome. And and it, I think we're, we'll have a band member to talk to soon. Oh, good. Yeah. I like I like those guys. I do too. They were They're here nice last to talk time. to. I wonder how much they, we've they got have donated. A new member, though. I know they have a new bass player. <laughs> yeah. We're excited to see the new bass player in action. And they're missing one horn of destruction. They are. It's true. There, there are several horns. There's a sub horn of destruction. And Charlie's, Charlie's giving awesome. my mom reflexes like overload by skating on wet. Yeah, he needs little wheelie shoes yeah. to do that. I hate those little wheelie shoes. Yeah. I, I hate the wheelie shoes. It's, the kids like them. They didn't sponsor, right? Yeah, they didn't, so we're not going to talk about it. <laughs> he does. I'm sure he does. Yeah. Seems like something Charlie would do. <laughs> Yeah, no. So these guys are getting all set up. You should be donating right now, please. It's still going to pair. 30hourday.org, 30hourday.org. And if you're saying, oh, here's Charlie now. We've got Look. Charlie. Here he is. Hey. Maybe we can maybe get somebody to widen the shot for us so they yeah. can see Charlie. Sorry, I'll just lean in. There he is. Come on over. Right. Everybody scoot in. We're in okay, good shape. Okay, there we go. Yeah, Hi. you're right there. 
No, I know I'm on the monitors, but that doesn't mean I'm on the feed. Yeah. No, no, I you are. No, right here. Feed, no, we're on the feed. Yes. See this? See this little corner? This Look little at the picture? smart window. That's what's going out to That's the internet you. right now. Oh, video ones. Yes. Yeah, I don't know if you can hear you. Yeah. Uh, well, no, I can hear you in the... So I would like you to say hello to your mom and dad. Hi, mom and dad. They're actually right over there somewhere. I know. That's why I told you to say <laughs> oh, hi to them. there's my dad, and there's my mom. And look, he cleaned his face before he came on stage. Oh, I was covered in Philly cheesesteaks. I want to say there's a Philly cheesesteak place back there. If you can hear me, I think your name is Ben. <laughs> hello, make Ben. really good Philly cheesesteaks. Well done, Ben. <laughs> okay, Charlie, why don't you introduce yourself? My name's Charlie. I'm the drummer for Target for Tomorrow and uh, the Horns of Destruction. <laughs> he's not only the drummer uh, for Target for Tomorrow and the Horns of Destruction, but he's also lackey extraordinaire, sound guy, uh, camera guy, camera cable operator. guy, yeah. yeah. Philly cheese. Somehow I was able to set up my drum set faster than the rest of my entire band could set up anything. <laughs> yeah, you know. Uh, Which is usually the other way around. That was really impressive. Yeah, honestly. that's great. That was very impressive. Because I got it down to a science. They're still all wandering around, like, you know, twiddling their thumbs. Twiddling their thumbs. Can we get a camera on that? How slow they are? You should do a time lapse, Please, actually. That would be great. <laughs> so, how is it that you managed to set up an entire drum kit before a. Uh, before even... Well, you know, uh, after you do it for like 15 years with tons of support from my parents and them kicking my butt to get it faster and faster, <laughs> uh, you basically turn into a pit crew with drums just by yourself. And so, Very nice. Yeah. My dad's like, where, I never did anything like that. Whereas, whereas <laughs> all of these people have only been playing their instruments for two days because they can't get them set up. Is, Actually, that, is that the implication? I got something pretty cool to talk about, though, which we should probably cover now because cover we won't it. be able to later. Okay. All right, let's um, go. If you saw us at the last 30-hour day, we had a really gigantic force on bass. Uh <laughs> And uh, he, he actually graduated and, uh, and, and went to UC Irvine to study chemistry. Um, so we he's been, smart as well as talented. Well, yeah, he also graduated like a 4.0. It's crazy. Yeah, he's super smart. We miss Jason a lot. Jason, I, I think you're watching right now, man. I'm going to be in Irvine hey, in like the end of August, so we're going to hang out. But uh, that guy, he laid it down on base. And through a random series of events, we ended up having some tryouts. And uh, Brittany who's our new bassist, tried out out of three people. Now, here's the, here's the story. Brittany shows up, and uh, we're all just like, all right, let's see what you got, because she's, uh, you know, we underestimated her, let's say that. And <laughs> she basically blew it all in our faces when she came. <laughs> like, it was just like, oh, my goodness, she's so good, it hurts. And she was probably the perfect replacement ever for Jason. Uh, we're definitely really, really excited to work with her from here on out. And uh, I just want to give a shout out to Brittany. She's over there busy right now. But yeah, you guys will see her on the webcast, and she's phenomenal. So that's really exciting. She's All the rest of us are still the same, so it's kind of boring. But. Well, it's not boring for us. We love you guys. I know, All right. True. Yeah. I love so wait. That. We love you guys. I know, right? We, yeah. <laughs> of course you do. What do we have a tally the... as to like how much money we've raised so far? Is there? Yeah, a... I haven't checked in a while. Yeah, I could before, go. I could go grab my laptop. Before and the check. last break, we'd raised two seventy. Do we have any fingers in the back? Like like a one, no. two, three, four, maybe five, seven thousand dollars. Right. Laptop. That's you how much. You guys keep checking. All right. Rick's gonna go get his laptop. Oh, we're, yeah. Rick's checking. He's gonna check for us. All right. You didn't call C check, so he's got to move over. All right. Sorry, you didn't. You didn't call. I know. Whatever. This is basically our really awesome attempt at stalling. Oh, yeah. another shout out to Max, our sound guy. Yeah. He's our dedicated Portland sound guy. Hi, Max, the dedicated Portland sound guy. <laughs> How are you? Yeah. He's doing well. Where'd Thumbs your hat up. go? Hey, I like this guy here in the Oregon State shirt. Again, no cameras on him, so you can't really tell, but I see orange <laughs> people, and he's wearing Oregon State, so it's true. You see orange people? Yeah, go Beavs. All right. You I know see some orange Duck fan people, is out there, really? and they're like, I see Rrr. orange people. Yeah, hey, I got a new co-host, Rick. You can stay back there. You're cool. All right. Yeah. No, it's all right. You can do all, like, the drum stuff and the AV stuff and the cables and stuff and still, like, sit here and co-host. You guys are in for a treat this time. I have to say, we, we've added a lot of cool stuff. Uh, piano, accordion, clarinet, all these... Uh, so you've added all this stuff, but it's all the same people. It is. So we, we actually do sort Except of a juggling Brittany. act as uh -huh. we play. It's kind of sweet. Nice. I didn't know you guys added an accordion. Neither did we until recently. <laughs> Oren was like, by the way, I also play accordion. Do you have some like, new songs as well? Yes, we have lots of new music. We took three months off to, uh, 
to write all new music for the Oregon State Battle of the Bands, which is probably our most favorite event other than this, of course. Well, uh, yeah, because we're awesome. And uh, we have some really awesome tunes in store for you, which I'd love to go play, but we're still stalling. Yeah, they're still, they're still having set up. I'm still amazed. Like, everyone else is still setting up, and the drummer it's, is on stage chatting with me. No, it's me. cool. It's cool. I I know it's cool. It's so. awesome. It speaks to your ability. Yeah. As a pit crew. As a pit crew. It also explains why so much got to, but I tell you if you skate on that thing one more time I'm probably going to have a heart attack. It's fun. Actually, the diamond plate is the easiest stuff to skate on cuz you don't get much traction. You realize that even me walking on the wet bricks I get three people well, you're in heels. If I was in, I, I'm in well, Converse. Well, yes, but still I'm I can walk in high These heels. These are PF flyers. I've been walking in heels for years. Faster. I still get told to be Stump careful. Fire. Be careful. Oh, Anybody be careful. get that? Anybody get that? You're killing me, Smalls. <sighs> <laughs> I love that movie. Oh, my God. This is amazing. So when we asked you to come back, yeah, which we did, I think, at the first 30-hour day. Yeah. Did we? I think it was a few weeks afterwards. It was a few weeks afterwards. I'm we a little went... upset, though. I got to say, I got a bone to pick with Dr. Normal. Dr. Normal, are you listening? There's no, a bone no, he's being busy. picked. He, he said we'd get video of the last one. I have seen no such thing. <laughs> What? Yep, yep. Oh, yeah. Same We've, with... One yep, moment's unhappy, too. too. They're not happy about it. Doc Normal, you're in the trouble. The bands are unhappy. You know what you have to do? What's do you that? know Morgan? Yeah, no, wait. Do Morgan. I know Morgan? I don't know if you... I don't know if you met Morgan. I know Hockley. Yeah. We, oh, we know Hockley. Twitter. Twitter yeah. friends. That's right. So you got to right. follow PDX Morgan. The problem is this, is that PDX Morgan... She's our Saturday girl, right? Oh. She comes in on Saturday. She handles everything for us. Oh. And then she advocates for the people she's dealing with, and she goes and she rips Dr. Normal a new one until he gets it done. <laughs> like nobody I'll else can do. So you them. find PDX Morgan, and you tell PDX Morgan to make it happen. I, I love believe. that we refer to each other on Twitter names, too. This is a true internet yes, telecast it here. It is. This is Cami Chaos. Yeah. Charlie Awesome. Charlie Awesome. Back there, we've I got to change Rosie. that. That's so corny. <laughs> really? I love You can that. change your Twitter name now. You can change your Twitter name. On the fly. Name. I think I should just change it every day for a week and really confuse people. Yeah, but then how would we tweet at you? Just Destructo Chuck. That's what I'm going to call it. <laughs> Destructo Chuck. Or something like that. Hey, Rick, are you Hey, what's come the ETA back? here, fellas? Five minutes? Five minutes? Five minutes, Turkish. Five, five minutes. Five minutes to showtime. Charlie, you said five minutes two minutes ago. Wait, a, wait, that shoot. I messed so it up. So we're actually getting pretty close to you guys starting decently ish, close to where. Wait, this is vocal. I gotta ask though, can you explain the tent? I don't get it. Which tent? There's two. There's one. No, there's two. Where's the other one? Back there. Okay, the one that you guys took so much time to set up. Okay, so that was Jay Mackin's tent, and that was a segment. It was the but why is he, camping why, out because... Is he going to camp here all night? Well, he was going to camp here all night until we figure out that he can't camp here all night, so now he's going to camp here <laughs> until 10. <laughs> and then he's going to close up shop. Of course. I, I see the tent rattling tent. around. The, t the tent is rattling. It's kind and then of then he's going to close up the tent, and then he's going to bring it over to our B location, which is a lot more like what you guys would be used to from last okay, time. Okay, what is this B location? I keep hearing about this. I have no idea what it is. Web Trends is sponsoring uh, Did you Wait, you talked day. about this earlier, I think. Yeah. Web Trends okay. is sponsoring 30 Hour Day by, uh, by providing us a B location, a place to shoot. Wait, wait, is this guy Web Trends here? Is that what this is? Yes. Yes, this is All Beer right. Blog and Web Trends. Thank you so Wait, much. Wait, come here and explain it. I need, what is web trends? Come on, Justin. Hey, Justin, yeah. come up. Check, one, come up and talk about web trends for yeah, us. This, is this, this one's on too. Look. Yeah. One, two, two. Or he can just have Rick's mic here. Mic check. I've come on up, Justin. Here. Two microphones and no turntable. I'm out of the chat. All right, yeah, I'm just going to shut up now. Oh, you can. Oh, am I ruining TV magic by putting Rick out in the back here? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, it's not television. It's not this television. Is this is vision. the internet. Everyone, this is Justin Kistner. Hello, everyone. Uh, he helped us to secure the place at Web Trends that we are going to be filming tonight from 10 p.m. until 10 a.m. That's right. So tell us about Web Trends, since they're one of our sponsors. Uh, so we do web analytics, and uh, specifically, I help us with the Facebook portion of that. Facebook, that's all good, because we're using Facebook to use causes that's to get money for the charities that we're raising money for. That's right. I actually just posted on Facebook a photo of this live feed letting people know it's down here. Nice. Bring some more people down. Very, very nice. Tweeted it. Tweeted it. Facebooked it. I decided it. to use the at 30 hour day. Should, should we be using a hashtag when we're tweeting that we're down here? I don't know. I put pound, pound uh, Pioneer Square. Nice. So I'm hoping that you know, I always just be, if it's something encourages that, location. If it's something that's a hashtag, or could be a hashtag, but it has a Twitter account, I always just use the at. 
I, I should use the geotag, but I'm, not a lot of people consume tweets that way. You yeah. Know, the ability so to, let me uh, ask you something. Yeah. Being a Facebook user, when we put something on Twitter, we tweet it. What, do you, what is it when you put it on Facebook? Uh, Facebooking. Facebooking? I was right. I've talked to a lot of brands that are really that? Uh, concerned with the ability to do both, so they yeah. call it face tweeting. <laughs> I think the first person I heard that from was uh, one of I don't the, like that. One of the guys behind the Obama campaign. Face tweeting. Yeah. I think I think I think we could do that. <laughs> Seriously, I'm not sure. <laughs> face tweeting. So, so you, not aside from setting us up, you also have some responsibilities tonight. I do. I'm in charge of logistics. Uh huh. Which is a fancy way of saying I've got the uh, magnetic key card. Yeah. And the codes to get up in the elevators. And to make sure people can get in. Secret Studio B. Yes, exactly. So we can come in and get our, our show done. That's right. We're going 10 to 10. Exactly. We've got another 10 to 10 segment here. Oh, yeah, we do. Which okay. we're hoping that, you know, isn't going to rain. I mean, we're in July. Why, why would we have to worry about... I'm wearing a jacket. You, yeah, you are. If I, if I weren't on, on stage with the lights, I would, I would require a jacket. Okay, come on over, Charlie. They need to see the hat. What is this? I keep just finding more things. I don't know. Yeah, well, that's the Helmut cam. We have three of those. Can we turn it on? Uh, we could turn it, it on later. It doesn't look like the Helmut cam that I don't know. I remember. <laughs> it's the family-friendly Helmut cam. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah. Here, I can hook it up. Hold on. It'd be like cold if you're on film set. Actually, I think a live drum feed would be pretty sweet. Is it on? Okay. It's, oh, wait, I need to check drums, I'm sorry. So, all right, we just take the helmet cam with you, I don't what care. Do you so, Cammy, one thing uh, people don't know yes. is that once we're done shooting at Studio B, yes. we're going to continue to shoot things in that space. That's correct. It's going to become, it's not going to be called Studio B, but it's going to become a studio. Studio Weapons. Yes, Studio Web, but not in the exact location yeah, sure. that we're filming. No, it'll be slightly uh, off to the left. Yes, to the left. So when is Studio Web Trends slotted for uh, starting? Started for a start date. What's this, their This start is its date? first production. Awesome. We're, gonna, we're considering this go time. Now, obviously, we have some due diligence, like you know, getting websites yeah. out and, yeah. and word and you know things like that. But uh, those are details. <laughs> so when will other productions begin? Do you think? Um, that's a good question. Yeah? So we have some... Are you looking at me? Yeah, like, hey, uh... <laughs> hey, Cammy. What are you planning to produce? Where, uh, where are you going to be? Oh, you, don't job. ask what Studio Web Trends is going to do. Ask what, what are you going to do, do with Studio, Studio Web, Web Trends? Trends? Very nice. So it's Let's like the incubator space of podcasting. Yeah, exactly. Very nice. Exactly. Very, very nice. So, I mean, we have, we have some great people okay, that come through the building. We have you know, Jeremiah Ouyang, uh Shell Israel was just in the house. So the ability to capture interviews with folks like that on the fly is going to be really nice. And then do some programming. <laughs> that was really sneaky, yeah. You know, that was working just fine. I could hear everything. These guys are looking pretty set up. They, yeah. Are you, hey. Charlie! Charlie forgot his sticks! Charlie, you... <laughs> Mr. I was all ready before oh. anybody else was even anywhere near ready. <laughs> That yeah. may be my uh, exit to, All right. to exit stage left. Okay, thank you, Justin. We'll see you tonight. Whatever. Hey, uh, somebody want to shut the door, maybe? Uh, okay. Hey, Rick, this yes. is my favorite part of the show. It is? Okay, okay well, so let's, let's get going. Hi. Hi, folks. Well, Still you know 275. What? Is what Be before, we, before we do what I like to do best, mm -hmm. I just want to say one more time, if you would like to donate, and we would really love for you to donate, please go to 30hourday.org, 30hourday.org, and you can click to, to donate through pauses. And for the next 30 minutes, our charity is Still Pair, uh, who mentors at-risk youth um, and youth in need here in Portland. And I was going to say, even right now, don't... Don't worry about donating. Get down here to the square to watch Target for well, tomorrow. Well, if you can get here quickly enough to watch them, hurry, you hurry, should. Because they're awesome. They're going to play for about the next half hour. So. Yeah, so <laughs> hurry. Half hour? We got an hour. You guys oh, have a full hour? You want to do a full hour? Come on down. See these guys. We're just going to really shift good. some stuff around. We'll I didn't know they had I would a full listen hour. To these guys. Yeah. I'm all about it. You guys play the full hour. Right now, our sponsors network Redux, and they're sponsoring you getting to listen. All right, what's yeah. up? Can, I, for tomorrow. can you start? Are, are you ready? ready? 
Is it time? So hear it? Oh, okay. uh, one one minute. We're getting to one minute, Mark. Yeah. I know Jason's That's all right. It was re- we were building up the excitement. Yeah. Can you hear it's that? Okay. I can hear it. A little bit of that? Yeah. yeah. They're getting ready. They're ready to lay it down. Ooh. Oh. 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 There they are. They can see them now. Yeah. Nice to see you. I just it, it, stuff. I got stuff. These walkie talkies. Get in the way. So we're gonna be yelled at. It's not a walkie talkie. What is it? It's an IFB. Don't call okay. it a walkie talkie. That's yeah. a. It's a CB. No. I BJ have, and the Bear. No. Oh. Oh. Right, we can go. Oh. Not, oh, are you ready? Oh, are you ready? Can we please? Yeah. Go over. Introduce to you Target for tomorrow and the Horns of Destruction. <laughs> Hi guys. Words will get through my head. Came to me late last night, a funny glow in his eyes. Spoke to me, told me of the story of his life. Listen to what he said. Salvation comes, it's not to the side. To get to hell is an unfinished ride. Don't let the man make up your mind. Never get lost in reality's speed of time. But I don't understand what he meant Yet I had a dream of the pictures he described Kings of puns of life and death the Judges and the judging men Only ones that matter come from deep inside the head Oh, pictures inside my head To be someone who believes all they see. I wanted to live in the dream, not the greed. I guess what I've learned didn't come from anyone else. I've learned what it means to say me. When salvation comes, it does not choose a side. The ticket to hell is an unfinished ride. Don't let the man make up your mind. Never get a
Thank you guys. How you doing out there? Max, when you get a chance, give me some more vocal in the monitors, please. So it's called now boarding. <laughs> Recording industry. When they meant all of what they said before the greed became the good, before the fame got to their head. So when the melodies come ringing through, they fail to make the mark. So every flame has its spark, just to crash
right, thank you guys. So for those of you guys out there, not on the internet, but actually out here in Pioneer Square, if you don't know, this is the 30 hour day. It's a 30 hour long internet telethon for a bunch of charities. It's good stuff. We're just getting kicked off for about an hour three right now. Anyway, this next song is called What Else? His stride, secretly he hides his mind. Fog around his eyes, his face, so damn familiar sight. Day, but the emptiness does not fade away. I never want to ever feel as ruined as my memories. Hey! What he sees Trying in the photographs So young, so naive And in the mirror gray yeah, The truth is much too hard to bear Still the words that an echo Dream is falling in death in But what else could he hope to know? I said what else could he hope to know? I said, what else could he hope to know? Do you believe it's only seen to whatever you want to deny Though you try to make way to have a stop in your way Kill it and be able to ask yourself, son Fight for our future, do you fight for yourself? Tell you say to whatever you want You deny those your shots Make way down with self And your way I'll kill today But ask yourself, son Do you fight for our future? Do you fight for yourself? Thank you. How's the sound out there, guys? All right. Hey, Max, can we get some more uh, vocals in the monitors, please? Excellent. Yeah, Charlie just wants his monitor to mix louder. I guess that's just one up. What's next? What's next? Hey, hey, hey. Hey. Hey, Doc. Need you tonight. All right. Thanks. Thank you. Y'all ready? Where's Michael? He's on his way. He's right here. When 
and I ever did deliver. I know I was unafraid of being silently inside your warm protection. But her eyes don't give dry today, said it to take it all away and lucidity to recognize only the lies in your disguise. Open up with Dan if I lose myself again. Oh, and now I'm scratching at an itch and I'm looking around and I ask me again, did I hear that sound? The swear we never wanted to be that little lie, but lately everything just seems so little less right.
come out to play test off the throne is on display ask what it means to be a man when fathers run and mothers say to pass good pass your hollow words so easily defeat when you hear them crying in the street your songs are fucked up gone with me Responsibility and rhyming to inspire children to cry who need their mothers, need their fathers so Respect is an entitlement. Well, that's really not my style. No handguns mixed with alcohol. I can do this for a while. If you really think about it, does your bravado compensate for your failed self-education? You say it's me who's second rate. So we crack our books and read about crooks who know just what you are. The TV shape on and our mistakes. You're almost certainly a star. Brittany Williams on the bass. Not fools, they all came out today They're gonna find a better way Cause in spite of your methods Truth can reach their ears And I know you're so afraid Recent wins are never paid But we're finished shedding tears To a place for the better years out We get a little more keys in the monitors, please. Again, we're talking for tomorrow on the Horns of Destruction. Actually, a lot more keys. Um, those of you guys who are familiar with us uh, might notice that we uh, kind of swapped out bass players. So our old bass player, Jason, ended up going to uh, grad school in UC Irvine. He's watching right now. Hi, Jason. But anyway, we, uh, we did some auditioning, did some looking around and found this awesome, talented young woman over here, Brittany Williamson. Say hi, Brittany. Yeah. I can what? barely hear it. You all right? Can we get any more of that? What? What drums? What? No, I just oh, need yeah. a. The line slides sideways Should I believe in what I see this time? What do I define? 
Young pudding pictures up on the wall They say it all and it sounds so good You're singing along such a beautiful song I forget what is wrong Just give me that sweet, sweet melody again, come on The cloth across your eyes does hide A truth I'd love to recognize So tell me what you mean When you say you don't know anything And is this just a dream? Does it feel so real? Yeah, it feels so real to me die so young should I begin to question what is right oh how am I divide when you're dropping notes at the end of the hall that's singing and all that it never sounded so good you're playing along such delectable song how could this be wrong when all you ask of me is but to taste a little harmony oh. Behind the cloth across your eyes hides the truth I'd love to recognize. They'll wonder how I ever got by alone. My solitude was sacred. I could trust everything. If you'd but only look at me. So tell me what you mean. When you say you don't know anything Is this just a dream? Cause it feels so real to me They'll wonder how I ever got by alone My solitude was sacred Could trust everything Feel but only look at me Thank you.
When you thought you learned your lesson, I was standing right beside. When you thought you'd found the answers, there was still so much to find. When the stars don't leave the sky, you know they're leaving us to die. Oh, don't you ever, oh you never, don't you ever want to ask them why? Reason that my reason could not find I was praying for a glimpse of all the secrets of your mind With the day becoming night, our song will leave us all behind Rain is never coming back, I mean to gather what is mine I know you love just to take me with you when you go And don't you just love to think I want good ever know Won't you just let me think all that I want to be Won't you just set me free From this insanity When you thought that I was listening To what you said before I was making up new meanings Your words became so much more Now I sure as hell if Slipping feet revealed to hold me up from the look you're wearing now, I can see right now. So my day taking life lessons, people I will never meet Much like asking for directions, walking down Chinese street My own trust a happy trade, I only wish I'd never stayed There a difference in your voice, and I can tell you were so afraid of You know I'd love just to take you with me when I go How I'd love just to think I want good ever know why can't I let you be all that you want to be? And why can't I set us free from my insanity? All right, we got two more left for you guys tonight. No Iron Man. No, 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 no. We got a few different instruments on this song, but uh, I want to thank all the people for putting together a 30 hour day and getting us out here today, putting on this event. And to our uh, good friend Max for coming out and helping us out with the sound. Thank you, Max. Kick out the all right.
This one's called Collections. Step up to the camera and give us a smile. You are welcome to stay, well, at least for a while. Just button up, dress down, you're one of the elite. But by winter, your anthem rings so bittersweet. To make you so sickening, late famous. Bovine breath, you prayed you could ignore. From dance, you never dreamt of owing. There was nowhere to run. Collections was knocking at the door. It seems what I've spoken to writers whose words in a door was just begun to wipe pages I've signed me up. I'm passing the lake, strange shapes laugh. That crooked jeer scratch the sour roof of the mouth in my ear. It stopped and I've rooted like the grass in the yard. Dark neighbor screams as if to say I'm better off that way. A veteran son, we always loved you but we don't know you anymore uh, to make me so sickeningly famous before fine print i prayed i could ignore from death i never dreamt of there was nowhere to run. Collections was knocking at the door. Head for the hills, holes I've dug. They're so riddled with pain and when I try to bury what clouds already witnessed. Just sit in the rain And oh, don't you love how it pours The way it washes over everything Their design was to put me away Down below with my beautiful surrender Chup! 
bills on another I'll be damned if I let myself tear us apart Let's reach out, reach out to each other Belong to a system of lies here to steal us away. Will I dare them to try? As we make our escape, I can tell you that Christ. One welcoming new scenery I close account three But still remain his shape Mother and dear, do you know What you brought home? Guess it doesn't take a prodigy Or irony to split the jaws And reveal the teeth Yeah, I knew I knew And how I wish she would have seen it She could learn to hold her From an honest man, of course, what this world has done to you, hard to believe it's true, but you can tell your friends. Your bitter boys deserve the right, it wasn't them, started the fight, we're gonna take good care of you, and never mind what you do, you do, just lock and load a trigger pull, we'll come names are all I'm selling you. What targets remain, what the moon lies ahead. Where the family is shut aside, where we've all been put to bed.
lovers of persons I never ever knew Just old games and code names are all he's telling you What targets mean, what the moon lies ahead When the world shuts its eyes, when our future lies on Ladies and gentlemen, in the 30 hour day, we are talking for tomorrow on the horns of destruction. Stick around for the rest of the 30 hour day. Have a wonderful night, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, guys. That was Target for tomorrow on the horns of destruction. <laughs> yes, they do. Yes, indeed. We don't really even have to sit here and talk very long, except that I think it's uh, important to note that we're not on camera. They're, they're swinging a camera over. I was going right. to say, I was yeah. going to say some stuff that might be important. Yeah. And, uh, uh, you know. Oh, look, there we are. Hi. Hi. Hi, us. It's not us for very long, though. You guys are yeah. really lucky we're going to get off stage and let someone entertain you. But I did want to note that we have switched over the, the uh, charity right now. We are, are done with pair for the time being, and now all uh, proceeds are going to go to the Oregon Food Bank for the next three hours. Okay. And uh, this hour is sponsored by Social Photo Talk. Ah, Social Photo Talk, who's also here taking the photos. Who's here the taking event. photos? Hmm. Socialphototalk.com. Interesting. Dot com. Interesting how that works. Mm -hmm. And our first, our first guest now after Target for tomorrow in the yes. Horns of Destruction yes. is Sasquatch. Oh. Legend of the Northwest Pacific. Hmm. Sasquatch. Sasquatch. Yoo-hoo. Sasquatch. Sa Sasquatch. Oh, there's Sasquatch. Oh, here he comes. I hope he can make he it over here. He looks a little here. tired. Here. Here's Sasquatch. Here. <laughs> Thank you, Cammy. <laughs> Thank you, Rick. Sure. I normally have a no photography rule because the pictures usually turn out grainy and your friends will argue about what you saw. However, for 30 hour day, I'll make an exception. My name is Sasquatch. So let's kick this off. I was in a sales meeting the other day and I asked a guy a question about his PowerPoint slides. It's a simple yes or no question. And the guy looks at me and says, does a bear crap in the woods? And I said, friend, I got two things for you. Number one, I'm not a bear. Second of all, I live in a 5,000 square foot condo. I drive an Italian car and I wear a Rolex. I crap in the Italian car. I got divorced a couple years ago. So ladies, I am looking for a lady friend. However, I figure it's all fur on the outside. So if you're a dude that likes Scrabble and Cook's Illustrated, just saying, get some coffee. Any cryptozoologists in the square? <laughs> Let's keep it that way. I don't want to see any plaster of Paris. <laughs> A few people have asked me already if it's true. Yes, I have exceptionally large feet. So naturally, I have exceptionally large shoes. I don't know if they're way homers or no way I was in a party the other night, and I asked the hostess a question about her interior decor. 
It was a simple yes or no question, and she looks at me and says, does a bear crap in the woods? I said, look, lady, I got two things for you. First of all, I'm not a bear. Second of all, a better question is when a bear craps in the woods, why does he have to walk around all day amongst so-called friends and coworkers and nobody can be bothered to say, hey, Sasquatch, you got some crap matted up in your fur. Like it's not happened to you folks. It's a daily indignity for me. Ladies, here's something for you. If you're camping and you leave the campsite to go use the bathroom, I am not watching you. I've seen enough of that crap on the internet. I was talking to Elvis the other day. He was giving me a bunch of grief about the size of my gut. So I took a dump in his car. It was a nice car. He bought it for his mom. I got a friend in town from the Himalayas. His name's Yeti. He's a cousin of mine, actually. He won't shut up about how hot it is in Portland. So I took a dump in his car. It's a nice car. It's a rental, though. D.B. Cooper borrowed 20 bucks from me last month, and now when he sees me, he pretends he doesn't remember. So I took a dump in his car. He's got a crappy car. It's, I don't know what he does with his money. I find myself dining alone in restaurants, not because I don't have any friends or anything, it's just I like to avoid that awkward moment when a friend wants to send their plate back because it's got hair in it, and I'm like, no, it's, it's, it's me. It's, it's my hair, it's not the chef. It's awkward. So I was uh, sitting in a restaurant the other day, and the server comes up to me and says, hey, would you like to hear our specials? I said, does the Pope wear a funny hat? She said, look, buddy, I got two things for you. It's not a funny hat. It's called the papal tiara. And as the preeminent symbol of the papacy, it stands for about 2,000 years of war, repression, and intolerance. So I took a dump in her car. I just thought I'd class it up with a lot of crap jokes. Uh, so here's one for you. What do you get when you cross Sasquatch with a pedicure? A suggestion for a Brazilian. I don't know if it works. Is that what it's called if it's for a guy? A Brazilian? I don't know. I just call it the Sasquatch. They know exactly what I'm talking about. I think Rick gets those all the time. He's always getting it waxed. My name is Sasquatch, and you guys have been awesome. I'm going to hand it back to uh, our lovely hosts, Rick and Cammie, and uh, drag it out if I have to. Have a seat. Have a seat. It's like, it's like Johnny Carson calling me over after a set, only I think you're supposed to have done well for him to call you over. <laughs> Work. It's hmm. like magic. I apologize for uh, those, the nature of some of those jokes. It's just, uh, you know, write what you know. <laughs> you know, and I'll I know. be honest, I, I would be worried about being nice to you, but I don't have a car that you can crap in, so. Uh, there's plenty of cars around the square here that you can do that in. <laughs> they say write what you know and, you know, eating berries and crapping. That's about, that's about all I know. <laughs> so what about all these sightings? Uh, some of them are me, just out and about. Uh, I like to go to the farmer's market. But uh, a lot of them are fakes. A lot Do you of, like uh, to make a lot of personal appearances? I mean, it, it was like pulling teeth to get you to come here tonight. Uh, I've got to admit, I'm a bit of a shut-in. <laughs> um, except uh, when Powell's is having like a Scrabble tournament, I like to go there. Yeah. Uh, that's, that's about all I get out, though. So, uh, Sasquatch... Are you Call me Sass. Sass? I like oh, Sass. Thank Sass. you. Right. Sass. Are you like unique? I mean, is it just you all by your lonesome, or is there like a whole species of you? And is well, Sasquatch your given name or the name of the species? Uh, my name is actually Chesterfield Horace Sasquatch. <laughs> okay. uh, 
But uh, people, you know, people like a name that's catchy. So Sasquatch, that's you know, kind of what I chose. And I, you know, I have a lot of cousins. Uh, you know, Yeti. He and I hang out a lot. Nessie, she's uh, across the pond, so to speak. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is there any possibility that we might talk to Scott for a minute? Uh, should I take the gloves off? <laughs> I might Ooh, be. That, I meant that I literally. Might be, I might be more comfortable. Yeah. Here, I'll hold your mic for you. In a moment, we'll get to talk to Scott Rogers. Yeah. Oh! Oh, hi. Hey, how are you? Hey, Scott. I don't know if I turn. Oh, it's still on. How's it going? <laughs> long, long time no see. Yes, it's been seven months, I think. Yeah, it's been since the last 30-hour day, if I'm not mistaken. Am well, I, I think mistaken? there were uh, I think there were some cocktails. There may have been, well. <laughs> mixed throughout the mixed previous months. Yeah. yeah, but you don't remember. Me drinking remember. cocktails. You, you don't remember, so. So how, how do you guys feel two-ish hours in? Is Good. it only two-ish hours in? Mm. Two, yeah. two hours and 34 minutes. We're no, doing, three hours. Three hours and 34 minutes. We're He's doing cheating great, us. Yeah. Wow, we are? Oh. Yeah. I, I thought it was two hours, and I was a little worried. But three and a half hours, I'm doing yeah, well. We're fine. Yeah. I lose track of time frequently. Yeah. I understand. You can imagine. Blackouts I, and wonder. waking up in strange places. <laughs> uh -huh. Well, yeah. It's not a joke. Yeah. I don't know why you're laughing. <laughs> Just, uh, yeah, sorry. we're laughing because you've made us uncomfortable with the honesty of the situation. <laughs> I, uh, I have a boo-boo. I, uh, I see that. You have an owie. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. Actually, I do know what happened. I'm just too embarrassed to say. <laughs> oh, good. Then you must tell us. I was, I was putting towels in the washer, and uh, I cut myself. <laughs> you, cut, you cut horrible. yourself putting it's pathetic. towels yeah. in the washer? The being a shut-in thing wasn't really a joke. It was. Yeah, I, no, I can, I can understand that. You kind of spaced out there for a second. I, are you doing all right? <laughs> I'm kind of a shut in myself, little, and yeah. I've been in open just, air all day. We're three hours in. I'm we not, not sure. Starting you know. to lose it. Well, to be fair, I, I would be three hours in if I woke up at four. I woke you're, up. You're three hours into 36 hour day, or you're six something. hours in Eight. to 40 hour day. Yeah. Something like yeah. that. Some, I don't There's know. Something. I've been awake I for a while. Don't do math. Doing the show. He's here just, you know. Whatever. I'm yeah, not I even just, sure why he's here. I think that's a good question. <laughs> why am I here? So uh, can I just ask a question about some of the inner workings of 30-hour day? Absolutely. Please How do. How many estimated costume and or apparel changes uh, do you foresee over the 30 hours? For who? Uh, for for both. For me. Or an average. Okay, hold on. I'm thinking, because, you know, Megan Kate does the wardrobe for me. I'm thinking she's got me in... Eight to ten outfits? Nine? nine? Apparently nine. it's nine. Wow, she knows. Eight to nine, ten was a good guess then. Nine, nine outfits. outfits. She's like hiding in a tent. <laughs> she is hiding she is. in a tent. She heard that and she's, answered. She's yelling from a tent. <laughs> I was in so much trouble for not answering that correctly. So Megan Kate has me in nine outfits. This is outfit two of nine. And Rick, uh, well, to be honest, Rick uh, procrastinated on his wardrobe. Ooh. We haven't picked all my outfits. Yeah, so did you just, just bring the dirty laundry bag? <laughs> I did, exactly. I picked a pile up off the floor. It's Megan sitting Kate in has Studio to go B. Through. Yeah, she's got to go through his wardrobe when we, yeah. get, to, Help when me we out. get back to Studio B. It, it's going to be We awesome. could crowdsource it. We could hold stuff up in front of the camera and figure out what I should wear. That's our next segment. I oh, think. good. I could hardly wait. I think that'll be fantastic. Mm. Well, Scott... Sasquatch, well, Cammy. If that is, in fact, <laughs> that your sort name. Sound of, sort of sounds like the... You've overstayed your welcome. <laughs> I was actually just going to ask where people could find you on Twitter and the Internet. Uh, Big Scotty on Twitter. Big that Scotty. That will uh, pretty much put you in touch with all the other places you can find me. What, what's the comedy blog? Uh, well, there's Curious Comedy Theater. There you go. I do go. a lot of stuff. That's Curious what Comedy. I would like you to plug. Okay. Uh, and I think those two sites, the Twitter, Big Scotty and Curious Comedy, those will get you in touch with a lot of fun stuff. All right. Well, cool. Scotty, thank you so much for joining I, us. Thank you, guys. Thank you. It's always great to have you here. And just one more question. Uh, should I go this way or that way? Oh, uh, why don't you should just I go just straight? fake it? Go yeah. straight. Just walk right at the camera. Yeah. All right, I'll charge right that. Head for Hockley. Mr. Yeah. Hockley. <laughs> Aim for Hockley. Aim for Hockley, and right. it'll all be He's, okay. That's always, a, that's always good all right, advice. Well, thank you, guys. Thank you. I don't know if you're reaching for the mic or my hand. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Both either. Yeah, sure. All right.